Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can customize voiceover typing on the iPhone 15 series. First, let's go back to the home screen by swiping up at the bottom of the screen. And from the home screen, tap on settings. Now in settings, scroll down and tap on accessibility. Next, tap on voiceover. Then scroll down and tap on typing. In here are the voiceover typing customizations that you can change. So the first item is the typing style. Tap on that will allow you to change to standard typing, touch typing or direct uh, touch typing. So select one of the style and then tap on the back key to go back. Next is the phonetic feedback. So in here you can turn it off or you can select character and phonetics or phonetics only. The next one is the typing feedback. So at the moment, yeah, the typing feedback is the characters and words. If you want uh, it to do nothing, you select nothing or it will give a character feedback or words feedback. Uh, for the hardware keyboard, it has been set to characters and words. Again, you can choose if uh, it to do nothing, characters or uh, words feedback. Next item is the modifier keys. By default, it is set to control plus option. You can uh, turn on or turn off cap locks or you can turn off uh, control plus options. And that's it. So after that, the last item is the keyboard interaction time. So here we got uh, the keyboard interaction time set to one second. You can increase or decrease the time by tapping on the minus or the add button. And that's it. This is the amount of time to wait before voiceover can start slide to type or make use of alternative keys on the software keyboard. After that, you can tap on the back key to go back to your typing. So this is where you can customize your voiceover typing on the iPhone 15 series. And that's it. Finally, you can swipe up to return back to the home screen. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel for my videos.